the weather is treating you well wherever you are in the world. Here in Sweden, we are actually getting ready to celebrate midsummer. And that typically means that we um, spend as much time outside soaking up the sun, which here in Sweden only sets for like a few hours each day. And on the actual holiday, uh, people will typically get together to eat and drink and uh, wear flower wreaths on their heads and uh, dance and hop around the maypole and sing a song about little frogs. If you have an interesting way of celebrating summer where you are, I would love to hear about it in the comments below. Okay, this week I will be showing you um, how I create a bird's nest with little eggs and a paper mache Eurasian blue tit. I think it's just uh, perfect timing to showcase this. It's bright and vibrant and full of life, much like it is here at this time of year. So I hope you enjoy. Just wadding up some paper to get started on the nest. The nest form is all completed and now it's time to get messy with some paper pulp. Nest is all dried and it's time to start painting with some Van Dyke Brown. Using some Van Dyke Brown and some Mixing White to start painting the papers that are going to make the twigs for the nest. Now it's time to start twisting up the papers to create the twigs.
finishing gluing in all the twigs so it's ready to paint. Using some Titan Buff and Van Dyke Brown to start adding color and dimension to the nest. Adding some more highlights with a even lighter version of the Titan Buff and Van Dyke Brown. Now for some burnt sienna to add a little bit more texture and depth. And now for a final layer of Titan Buff. Now on to making the eggs. I'm covering the egg forms in a paper clay to ensure a smoother finish. Using uh, some ultramarine blue and Titan Buff to color the eggs. Finally, some Van Dyke Brown ink to create the speckles. Time to make the form for the bird. Bird form's complete, and now it's time to get messy again with the paper mache mixture. Time to make the tail and the wings.
forget to make the head. for the wire to create the legs and feet. all completed now it's time to start adding the paper mache mixture to create the texture and details Time to get painting with some diorolide yellow and white.
time to bust out the titanium white for the white accents on the nude. Now for some Payne's Gray mixed with titanium white to start adding in the blue accents. Now for some muted gray for the legs, beak, and eyes. Finishing everything off with a few layers of Liquitex Satin Varnish. To admit this uh, week's project was a bit more challenging than I actually anticipated. That nest nearly had me done in a few times but um, I'm really happy with how it turned out. Look how cute that is with the little eggs just nestled in so perfectly and I actually brought up the uh, stump with the lamp piece on top. So you could see how it is uh, put together. Uh, this sweet mama bird is uh, protectively perched and keeping an eye on her babies and waiting for daddy to come back uh, with some food. So, I hope you enjoyed uh, watching this week's video and if you haven't already, please don't forget to uh, click on the subscribe button below and turn on your notifications so that you can see what I'm up to next time. Until then. Mm -hmm.